Well, I got to tell you, weather has been better for practicing football, I guess, with all the equipment on. It's been a little bit cooler, dew points down. Actually, turned out to be pretty cloudy during the afternoon. It is cloudy right now over Lake Champlain and also Burlington, where it is 73 degrees. The dew point at 55, which is feeling good. We will take it. So, temperatures above and beyond one of the cooler spots, definitely Saranac Lake, where it is 63 degrees right now, 69 in Newport. Then you get back into the 70s, places like Lebanon, right on down to Keene. Bennington right now is at 72 degrees. All right, Storm Tracker 5000. We found more clouds around by the afternoon. Just want to give you a heads up. If you jump the border here, you get into Ontario, we've got some rain showers. Nothing heavy, that's for sure, but this upper level low pressure system is slowly but surely moving from the west on off to the east. So some of these showers most likely getting into at least parts of, well, it looks like into St. Lawrence County, also into Franklin County, and the St. Lawrence Valley could get just a little bit wet here. We're not talking about a ton of rain, but we will continue to keep an eye on that for you. Meanwhile, the upper level low affecting a lot of areas, especially up in Canada. But you can even see if you come on down into western New York, parts of Pennsylvania, there is some effect, although some of this looking like it's lake effect rain showers. I want to take you out to the Atlantic Ocean, keeping an eye on a tropical system. That is Erica. It is a tropical storm. Let's put a track on this thing. Now, the National Hurricane Center down in Miami changing the track just a little bit. It's not a strong storm. Winds right now sustain 45 miles an hour. It's moving west at 17. It's kind of it's it's kind of gone to the north a little bit in terms of the track here. So we'll go ahead and light this thing up. It looks like it wants to go just north of Puerto Rico, at least the middle of the cone of uncertainty here. Also north of Hispaniola, and then it starts to turn a little bit. So earlier today, looked like the center of this cone was a little bit closer to Miami. Now it's going a little bit farther north. On the peninsula of Florida. Now we will see if it continues to turn a little bit. Also, right now the thing is not all that organized, but forecasters thinking that by the time it makes landfall, at least the current forecast here, it may be a Category 1 hurricane. So we're not talking about a major hurricane by any stretch, but of course these things still can drop a ton of rain. We will watch that for you. Low pressure at the surface right here. We've got a trough of low pressure. Also, as you come on back to the west, upper level stuff. So that will affect us a little bit tonight into tomorrow, and then high pressure will start to settle on in. Friday, Saturday, both days looking good. This is Futurecast, 715 tonight, maybe an isolated shower. Into tomorrow morning, I think we see a lot of clouds, but we end up with partly sunny skies and the chance for a few isolated rain showers throughout the day. So for tonight, partly cloudy skies, some isolated showers, most we think, will be in northern New York, 58 degrees at your low tonight. Now, tomorrow, a little bit cooler than today. Today, a little bit cooler than yesterday. 75 Burlington, 74 Plattsburgh. We do not get out of the 60s again in the Adirondacks. Springfield at 76 degrees, becoming partly sunny after clouds in the morning, and we may find just a few isolated rain showers. In the Champlain Valley, clouds in the morning, otherwise partly sunny, few isolated showers, best chances again in the afternoon. Temps at 75 for highs to 57 tomorrow night. Friday, partly to mostly sunny, 77 degrees. Saturday looking good, partly sunny, 80. Sunday not bad, partly sunny, but the chance for a couple of showers. Just a little unstable. We're watching that for you. We go from 79 to 82. Partly sunny Monday. I like Tuesday and Wednesday. A lot of sunshine both days. The high on Tuesday, 84. The high Wednesday, 85.